Hi, wenn wir der Bugs haben, um Minecraft zu zählen, habe ich schon auf the new update for Computer Crafts, which is version 1.3.1. So it adds uh, two new features, which are monitors and GPSs. This is a monitor, and you can put many side by side. And as long as it forms a rectangle, it will they will actually join and form just one monitor. So I'm just going to use a 2x2 two two monitor. It should be just fine. So how do you activate monitors? Very easy, you just need a function, which is monitor. Uh, then you indicate the side, so in our case it's left. And finally was the program you want to run. So um, I'll start with hello, which will just display hello world on the monitor. Notice it won't display anything on the um, computer itself. However, on the screen it will display hello world as it should. So then uh, there are many other programs you can run, such as, I don't know, the edit uh, program, which will help edit any program, you know, uh, the program used for editing, um, so S, let's call it S, never call the program S, so you get the editing page, you know, and you can edit whatever you want, it will even display on the screen, however, uh, one annoying thing is that it won't display on the computer itself, so it's pretty useless um, to do that. Uh, now for the other feature, GPSs, um, you need when you actually use GPSs, you need three hosts. So a host will um, be a computer, which will be computer, computer, can't speak today, completely frozen, and um, uh, it will um, serve its entire existence to um, serving GPS requests. So I have activated two for a moment, and I have to activate the third right here. And notice I'm using monitors to actually monitor the. Um, GPSs and um, it's more useful because well like that you don't need to actually look on the computer and all um, so yeah how do you activate so very easy to it's just GPS uh, in our case we want a host so it's host and um, then you have to type the position and uh, the position has to be accurate because otherwise, otherwise it won't work correctly. So to find out you just have to press F3. Uh, I have already checked and by memory I believe it's 78, 57, 76. Uh, I'm doing that by memory so it might not be accurate. And however I'm going to be using the monitor to uh, go over that. So I have to type monitor before. Um, on the right side and there it should work running GPS on the right side no moding active opening top mode in position done serving GPS requests and all and now it works so how do you locate this time let's take this computer and it's, uh, just GPS dot locate and that's all you need uh, no it's not dot locate uh, no but it, it will uh, return the position and I believe it's the right position. I'm not sure about this one. So then we can press F3 to figure this one out, but my computer is a bit too slow to actually give me that. Notice the graphs even go uh, over the numbers, so it's not practical, if I may say. Um, so, so yeah, that's all about GPSs. Oh, actually, no, there's one other function, so for it, it's an LUA, it's gps.locate. I never got it to work, however, but um, I'll just show you how it works, basically. So it's gps.locate, and then you indicate uh, the time the computer will actually be f not frozen, but it will be de entirely dedicated to determining its position. Um, for two seconds it will freeze, and then come back to normal. Um, so I, I'll try something very quickly. Um, so this normally should return the X, Y, and Z Z position of the computer. However, it will not work, unfortunately, and I don't know why. So it will freeze for two seconds, and X will still be nil. Um, so it won't work. I can try for twenty seconds, and that will allow me to explain something else, um, a little project I've been working on, um, but I've been a bit too lazy to actually figure out the code. 
which is a tic tac toe. I actually mentioned that uh, in my previous video uh, on turtles, and um, so the way it will work uh, basically is that um, each turn, so that's when both uh, myself and the turtle play, it will before each turn it will actually scan the entire um, grid and determine whether the, um, there is well there has been a change or not. So and then it will um, put everything in the table. So it's a bit complicated to um, explain everything in depth and I'm not even sure uh, how I'll program most of the uh, yeah, most of the tic tac to itself. Uh, but if ever I manage to finish it, um, I'll let you know. So now the GPS should be ready. It should. If I manage to get down. Uh, come on. Okay. Does it return it to anything? Nope, still not. So I have no idea how it works. Um, maybe I should try something else. GPS, how does it work? Hmm. What? Oh. Help, GPS API. So, um, it gives a function and it gives a time out. If it receives enough responses to dip in, determine this computer's position X, Y, and Z, it will return, otherwise it will return nil. If GPS hosts do not have their position configured correctly, the result will be inaccurate. Okay. Never mind, maybe I just have to put like a whole minute before it um, works, but I don't want to try that. Never mind. So, uh, I guess I'll be seeing you next time. Um, yeah, so that's all for today. If you enjoyed, please remember to like, comment, subscribe. And um, I guess I'll be seeing you next time, so see ya.